Welcome my dear friends into my YouTube channel. Today I am going to create a toolpath library in ArtCam 2017 version. For this video, I almost create this kind of vector file to create toolpath for this. Okay, let's let's we can start. First of all, I am going to add raw material for this. Uh, I am use 20 millimeter thick raw material for this one. Right. Okay. Now I can start adding tool path. For this, I am going to use profile tool path. Then select along the vector. Now I can go to the toolpath library like this this is my tool library I have many kind of tools 20 millimeter end mill 10 millimeter end mill and ball nose in this place V bits now I am going to create uh, another 90 degree V bit right okay I am going to the add tool then I can put a name for this one I use 90 degree V bit like this then I have to select V bit you can see the figure of this selected tool type I use V bit then diameter of the tool and put 20 then angle angle is 90 step down I am at 8 millimeter then step over as 2 millimeter Spindle speed I use 500 sorry 15,000 then uh, feed rate 40 and plunge rate 50 right then when I click OK that tool added to the my library this is that Tool. like this I can create many kind of tools right okay let's we can check the simulation with that tool I am going to select this one then I will add some profile tool calculate then I am going to take simulation this is the simulation with that tool I right, okay I am going to add another tool for area clearing um, for that I select my secondary vector this say I am select this vectors and go to the tool path then area clearing then I am going to add tool in this place also I am going to create a end mill tool right I am going to select a location and create a tool go to the add tool and select this sort drill this is type of end mill uh, I am going to create 4 millimeter in mill I use my name here to
4 mm step down same 4 mm then we that sorry step over 2 mm uh, spindle speed 24000 speed that about 45 plunge rate about 15 I right, talk okay. then click ok you can see this tool in my li library ok I am going to select that tool then same as previous I am going to calculate tool path right now I am going to simulate ok now I can check what is the final outcome ok same as this way I am going to create another tool like this kind of V bit router bit with this tool I can get very good quality product so let's start to make that kind of tool right. I am going to delete this simulation right. this profile tool path I am going to change into that kind of router bit I am going to select then add the tool I am going to add into this location add tool then you can right I am going to select this round over tool you can see the appearance of this kind of tool now I am going to create 16 millimeter right diameter is 16 I am going to use radius as 7.5 or 7.75 then step over 4 millimeter spindle speed about uh, 15,000 feed rate 42 and plunge rate about 15 right then click ok I haven't had that step down right ok let's select that tool and calculate again right then I am going to simulate with this tool you can see it's a nice appearance it's nice looking I am going to simulate second tool path two. This is the appearance with 
that tool mm, as you need you can create that kind of tool into your library then you can check exact simulation with your tools thank you